November is coming to an end, and now is when we need to start stocking up our stores with brand new products that are going to be trending in December 2023, going into January 2024. It's almost New Year's! Every month, there's new trending products, whether that be a seasonal trend, something that happens every single year around the same time of the year, or simply just passing trends that you want to hop on to make a quick buck. Today's video is going to focus on the top 10 products that you should be dropshipping in December 2023, along with some expert tips to help you start marketing them and start making some profits. So with that, let's go ahead and get started. Now, before we do get started with the countdown, remember to go along with this video, just like every other top 10 video that we have, we're going to be giving you an easy to reference cheat sheet with all of the different products and all of the different links to the products to make things that much easier for you. And if you want access to that, all you have to do is go ahead and comment down below, hashtag December 2023, and let me know which one of these products was your favorite. After I see that you want to and did that, I'll reply back with a link to the sheet. Oh. Let's get started. So to kick off this list, the first item is going to be a pair of orthopedic running shoes. Now, this is a very long Facebook ad, so we're just going to quickly skim through it because truthfully speaking, I don't want to spend a minute and 22 seconds just watching this ad for shoes that I'm not going to buy. OK, we got to talk about this. You guys said you saw these as well. I absolutely love comfort wear. I highly recommend it for anyone suffering from foot pain. Or OK, so they're showing you how they come through. It's a lot of B-roll. Now my question is, on that talk show, are they actually referring to these shoes in particular? I don't think so. I think they're just using it as some sort of voiceover. All right, so pretty much all they're doing through this entire video is simply just talking about the benefits of the shoe, how they can help you out when you're running, and how comfortable they are. It's just primarily first-hand accounts and reviews. Let me fill you guys in on a little secret here. So what they did here is they went ahead and they took a sample from a talk show. They most likely added right here foot pain shoes because this is not the original text. This doesn't even look like the original text. This honestly is completely different quality than the entire rest of the video. Now, this is something that I'm noticing because I always notice like these little minor differences in images and videos. I'm very big on quality. This was added on maybe Adobe Premiere Pro or CapCut or simply just an editing program on the phone. And that right there where she said, I absolutely love comfort wear, that was not her. So either they used an AI voice, they generated an AI voice using a sample from that, or that's just simply somebody else talking. The way that they started this off really makes you think that they're referring to these shoes in particular when realistically speaking, they're not. Anytime that they mentioned comfort wear throughout the video, I can almost guarantee you that that is AI generated. But aside from that, looking through some of the comments, they have 11,000 likes, pretty good amount of comments, 1.9,000, just got mine, I love them, awesome, just order them, got mine, and just got mine. So overall, they do have some pretty positive comments, which is good because that's honestly the best social proof that you can get. So checking out their website, you have Ortho Stretch Cushion Shoes, and typically they're $90, but they're on sale for $59.95. They have a few different selections when it comes to colors, a few different shoe sizes. I like the fact that they have US and Australian, so it's pretty clear. People know what sizing to reference instead of just guessing. Aside from that, the website itself is actually pretty clean. I like their logo comfort wear with a little circle with feet in it. It's very niche specific. It really references the shoes. It gives you a bit of comfort in actually making the purchase. They got a good banner up here. Use Black Friday for an extra 20% off. It's an updated promo code, which is also really good. A lot of times here, you'll have a promo code from maybe three or four months ago, which kind of shows you that people aren't really taking care and updating their website. Aside from that, they have some really high quality images. Their text over here is perfect. It's got some pretty simple icons. It's easy to read a GIF, a little bit of information and a CTA to buy more. Aside from that, if you scroll down a little bit more, you have one of my favorite things, and that's reviews. I love seeing reviews, especially with images. Aside from that, that's pretty much all they have. It's a clean website. It's easy to navigate. I like this website. I think they did a great job. So let's pull out our calculator and let's start getting things ready. So for this, it's going to be $59.95. Now let's add about $13 for shipping. So we're looking at a total of about $72.95. Now let's check out how much they're actually running for. I see what you did there. So looking over at AliExpress, they're running for $20.12. I'm not going to be going by the sale price because that can always change. Now, as far as the shipping, it's showing us that it has free shipping. So $72.95 minus $16.30 leaves us with a profit of $56.65. This is a really good item. This is a very high ticket item. Making over $50 selling one pair of shoes is a fantastic profit. Next up at number two on our list, we have an electric drill plate cutter. And here we see this guy who's very inefficiently cutting something, but then he switches over to the drill plate cutter. And this, this is revolutionary. It's actually really cool. It allows you to simply cut thin sheets of whatever material it is. So something like that would be made a lot easier with this type of cutter. This is actually something that's very efficient. 
It looks like it could be something that a lot of people use, obviously, of course, outdoors. And this is something that would be heavily marketed towards DIYers. So people that love do-it-yourself. Now this ad, I think actually was done very well. Um, it's pretty short, it's 17 seconds. It's pretty ideal, but it did incorporate an entertainment element at the beginning, which is this right here. They show some random guy trying to cut a piece of metal and he's got a very makeshift shield or protection on. And then it switches over to the solution, which is the blade cutter. It's got 8.5 thousand likes, 3.1 thousand comments, and over a thousand shares. It's got some pretty good interactions. Now let's take a look at the website that's selling it. So this is Relaxed Ink. Um, honestly, this logo and the title really don't have much to do with the item itself. So me personally, that's something that I'm always very critical about. I like to have a matching logo for whatever it is that you're doing. Now, obviously this is more geared towards a generic store, but this could be more of a generic logo. This isn't really anything that has to do with relaxing. Aside from that though, the website is pretty clean. It's straight to the point. It's got a little bit of information and a few images. This is the standard dropshipping website, but at the end they did add the reviews, which I always think is a great touch. Aside from that though, I don't like the structure of this. I don't like how it's just simply some text and then an image and then text and then an image. This could be structured a lot more cleanly. You could have the images on one side and then some of the text on the other side. It's just, it's a little too messy for me. So this one right now is going for $99.99. And now let's check out our supplier. Let's go over to AliExpress. And this is running simply for just $5.57. Now this is the welcome deal. Um, I'm gonna go with the full price, which is $22.49, which is still a pretty good profit. So now let's subtract $22.49. Shipping is free. And that gives us a potential profit of $77.50. Today's top 10 is full of high ticket items. All right, so up next on our third spot, we have a dog calming pillow, which, I mean, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. To me, that's just a pillow. <laughs> There's really nothing special about it, but if it works, right? So right off the bat, what they're showing is simply dogs using it. They're showing the owners putting it under the dog's head, making them more comfortable, potentially relieving anxiety and just helping them be calm and comfortable. So let's check out some of the comments. It's actually got some really positive ones. It's got over 11,000 likes and loves. It has 1.7 thousand comments and over a thousand shares. Primarily, it's just people tagging other people which honestly, that in itself is pretty good because this can give you a lot more free exposure. So you run a Facebook ad, you pay a certain price, but then when those users start commenting and tagging other people, there you start to get some extra exposure for pretty much for free. So let's take a look at Pup Zen. This is a website that's selling the item and currently it's going for $29.99 with free shipping. But if you don't buy it now and you purchase it after midnight, you're gonna be paying for shipping. No, you're not. They have their free shipping banner over here as well. The name of the brand itself, PubZen, I think is great. I think their logo is pretty good too. It's a simple outline of a dog. But checking out the actual website, we can see they have a few different variations. You can adjust the quantity through here. Pretty easy to navigate. Some high quality images, all showing the free shipping guarantee, which shows free shipping here, but then here it tells you that free shipping ends at midnight. So these are some things that you should consider. Make sure that everything on your website matches. So don't put free shipping on the images themselves put it on your banner or put it on something like this on a badge. Don't advertise free shipping directly on your image unless you're always gonna have free shipping, which chances are tomorrow this is gonna say the exact same thing, but make it match. Aside from that though, let's go ahead and scroll down a one-way ticket to Sleep City. I like that. That's clever, it's quirky, it's unique, shows a little dog sleeping. It goes nice, it goes well. It's a nice little touch. The perfect height and softness. So it has a little bit of information. It's not overbearing with text, which I like. And it just shows images of the pillow and the pillow being used. Aside from that, it's got a few trust badges. No reviews, unfortunately. I think this website is pretty good. I like the color scheme. I just personally like this color. But other than that, it's clean. It's easy to navigate. The only things that I would change is, like I said, this free shipping guarantee on the image itself. I would take that off. And down here, just add the reviews. If you don't have reviews, there's apps on Shopify that can help add reviews for you or import reviews from, let's say, AliExpress. So let's talk about the important thing. Let's go with money. So $29.99. And checking our supplier, you can see that it's running for just under $8 with free shipping as long as it's over $5. So you should be getting free shipping, unless you purchase it at a discount, in which case you're not gonna qualify for free shipping. But then it would kind of average out to about the same, so let's just go with $8. So $29.99 minus $7.53. That's gonna give us a profit of $22.46. Not bad. Now let me stop right here really quick and let me ask you to do something. Go ahead and smash that like button if you're enjoying this video so far. Also, if you're not already, please consider hitting that subscribe button as well. Next up, we have a disposable toilet brush set. So let's check out the Facebook ad. 
right off the bat they're showing you exactly how it's used how easy it is to attach the well attachments and how well it works in the actual toilet it's very versatile the, the head actually swivels from the looks of it and it's easy to detach and start over again all right so let's check out large lie large lie i'm not a huge fan of that name simply because it kind of implies that your products are a large lie so taking a look over here so far we have the basic store it's kind of just like all of the other ones that we've seen as you can tell this is a generic store they're selling clothes household supplies toys beauty and makeup a little bit of everything so let's check out the item itself it's currently running for $13.63 it's got some pretty high quality images on the side it's got a few different options and they're all going to be priced differently because they're all going to be different things so first you have the toilet brush with the 18 piece brush set you have two different scents the lemon and the ocean both same price oh and you have a lavender as well and then you have the actual head replacements so these are running for $4.95, whereas the entire set runs for $13.63. Now this is showing free shipping on orders over 12 or 13 pounds. And I'm not entirely sure what the conversion rate would be, but it equals out to $10.96. So you would be paying for shipping on the set. Now, if you purchase a set along with a brush head replacement, then you would be qualifying for free shipping. So, so far, everything looks pretty basic, the same as any other drop shipping website. And you got your typical images, pretty basic, not my favorite way of doing things. I think it's too generic, but to each their own. So now let's run over to our supplier and let's see how much money we can make. Now, these aren't going to be the exact same ones that you see on here. Although they are very similar, they're not going to be the exact same ones. At least they're not always going to be. One thing you have to keep note when it comes to these types of products is that there's going to be a lot of similar products with a few minor differences. At the end of the day, they're all going to do the same thing. Some of them are going to be similarly priced. Some are going to be a little bit pricier than others. And that's why you need to look around to find the best option with the best pricing. We can see that they have the set A and they have a few different ones. They have the set A lemon, lavender. Now here for one set, they're selling it for $13.63. Now running over here to AliExpress, they're selling it for $8.61. So minus 861 so this gives you a potential profit of five dollars now while that doesn't seem like a lot you have to remember that with these types of products a lot of people also buy the consumables so a lot of people are going to be buying extra brush heads as well and on top of that whenever they run out of the brush heads they're going to come back to your website to purchase more so while you're not making a lot of money from one sale you could be making a lot of money from multiple sales overall throughout time now i did do something different in this one i took into consideration the sale price rather than the full price and that's because if we look over here we can see that they're selling it for 13.63 and here it's for 16.24 if we were to take into consideration this price we would be in the negative if this goes back up to 16.24 then this one has the potential of going back up to 2603. This already depends on how you're running your store. One way that you can prevent losing money by not having your prices updated is simply by implementing automation. So when you implement automation into your dropshipping store using AutoDS, you get the awesome feature of price and stock monitoring. So what this does is it'll keep track of your supplier's prices and your supplier's stock quantities. So if they ever run out, your inventory will reflect that almost immediately. So that way you don't miss out on a sale and you don't miss out on any profits. If their prices change, then your prices will change accordingly. You can set it to change automatically by either using a dollar amount or a percentage. So let's say your supplier increases their price for about $10, then your product will do the same. AutoDS will set your product to go up by those $10 if you choose to go that way. Next up, we have a manual dumpling pressing machine. So for this, we're gonna check out a TikTok ad and here you can see what they're simply doing is just putting the dumpling into the little presser and pressing it again. And there you go. You have a dumpling. Something pretty cool about this is the fact that this doesn't necessarily have to be used just for dumplings. This can also be used for something like a Spanish empanada. empanada. Here we have Elico again. I'm not a fan of this name. It has nothing to do with the item itself. Obviously, this is a generic store as well because they have women, women's shoes, women's purses, sunglasses, men's items, hair, feet care, literally anything you could think of. So we have the manual dumpling pressing machine, creative dumpling making machine. I'm never a fan of such long titles. I don't see the point in it. Honestly, this could have been good enough with just manual dumpling pressing machine. That's it. Let's check out the images. They have some pretty high quality ones, just a few different colors, rest assured and practical, healthy and safe PP material. All right, so overall it's got some pretty decent quality images. They're not the highest of quality, but they're good. They're not blurry. You can read them. You can understand what's going on. So checking out the price, it's selling currently for $34.92. Let's go ahead and take note of that. 
34.92. They have a few different colors, the different variations. Oh, apparently it's on sale and it ends in just one hour. Ooh, we better make a purchase now. But then if you keep scrolling, you have the same thing as always, just different images, except with no text. This time the text is in the actual images, but this right here is not structured well at all. This just makes the website look kind of silly and at the same time kind of empty because here on the left, there's nothing here on the right. It's the exact same images that you see on here. So honestly, this right here, the description, it's not placed well at all. I don't think it's good. I don't think it looks good. I don't think it instills trust in the consumer into making a purchase. So if I were them, what I would do is completely restructure the description part, delete all of these different images. They're already in the pictures anyway, and just talk a little bit about the product, maybe add a video that shows how the product is used. And of course, as I always say, add some reviews because they don't have that here. So let's take a look at the price over at AliExpress. It's currently running for $8.28, down from $15.62 with free shipping. So even if you buy it on sale, you are going to get free shipping because it's an order over $5. So it's being sold for $34.92. Now let's subtract our full price of $15.62. Obviously, we're not including shipping. And this equals out to $19.03. Still making some pretty good profit so far. Okay, so next up on our sixth spot, we have a vehicle de-icing tool. Baseball's the flamethrower! Let's take a look at the Facebook ad for this, which right off the bat, just looking at the first frame, it looks like it's already going to catch somebody's attention. And there we have a car sliding through ice and boom, it slams, causing an accident. All right, so let's see how this little tool can help us out. So this seems to be a simple tool that you leave inside your car and it warms up your entire car to melt the ice from the outside. Interesting. Makes me kind of think that the inside of the car might be pretty hot, but... I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter if there's this much snow going on, right? So really the entire ad is just people struggling with the snow and it doesn't give you an actual product demonstration. That's one thing that's kind of getting to me. It shows you a demo of it. My suggestion when it comes to this product, if you live somewhere where it snows and this is a common problem, order this item, record a video, show how it works and show a real life case study. Don't just show an animation. Aside from that, it shows an end result, which is a completely clear car. Scroll down a little bit. Let's check out the comments. So we can see that it has 868 comments over a thousand shares and 4.9 thousand reactions. Some laughing, some with a thumbs up. I would like to get one for my dad. He'd be thrilled to have this. Congratulations on such a unique and hopefully helpful product. Interesting comment. All right. So, I mean, overall the ad is all right. I think it could be done a lot better. Uh, I would go with something similar to this. I like what they did with the whole showing the exaggerated ice on the cars, but I would go with an actual case study and show the product actually in use, short working. Aside from that though, checking out the website itself, we have Ovilago, Ovilago, the <sighs> The actual item is called Ovilgo, I guess, and the company name or the website name is called Laviaron. Worldwide shipping with fixed with fixed rate, six dollars. So you get six dollars shipping throughout the entire world. The item itself costs twenty-five dollars and ninety-seven cents for one of them. So let's go ahead and do some math. Twenty-five ninety-seven plus five point ninety-nine for shipping. So our total cost is gonna be thirty-one dollars and ninety-six cents from this website. So they have the vehicle maximum microwave molecular de-icing instrument. I would take this off. I wouldn't do instrument. I would do something better. Cruelty free, eco-friendly, 100% satisfaction guarantee. Always watch your spelling. Please always watch your spelling because it is guarantee, not guarantee. It's things like this that will really make a customer think that your website is fake, that it's a scam, that it's a fraud. Always make sure that you have proper spelling. We have the item price, then we have a little bit extra, two pieces for a discount, three pieces, five pieces. Then just like a lot of the other websites that we've been on, it's just images with text. Let's see if they have reviews. And they do have reviews. So they have a 3.4 out of five stars with 20 reviews. So checking out our supplier's website over at AliExpress, we can see that it's being sold for $3.69 down from $8.57 with $3.28 shipping. So let's take out our handy dandy calculator. Let's subtract the full price, which is gonna be $8.57. And then let's subtract our shipping cost, which is gonna be $3.28. That gives us a grand total of a potential profit of $20.11. Okay, so up next on our list, we have a sun visor phone holder. Now, unfortunately, the Facebook ad that we had for this was taken down for whatever reason, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you a similar ad, which honestly was just the video that they have on the supplier's website. We can see that all they're doing is showing you simply how it works. So you attach the phone holder to your sun visor, you pull down the attachment and you attach your phone to it. That's really all there is to it. It's easy to look at while you're driving 
and you can even use it in the back seat so that way people can stay entertained or you can even use it while you're cooking. Now for this, we're checking out Amazon and we can see that it's being sold currently for $19.99. So let's jump over to our calculator and let's do $19.99 and let's check out AliExpress. Here they're selling it for 99 cents. But as always, we're not gonna go for the sale price, we're gonna go for the full price. So let's subtract $12.86. And that gives us a potential profit of $7.13. That's not bad for such a small item, for such a common item. All right, so next we have a cozy knit set for women. So let's check out the Facebook ad. So right off the bat, we can see that somebody is actually wearing it. So they're wearing the entire set, the top, the bottom, and the robe. Then they simply just switch to all of the different variations that they have available. That's pretty much all there is to it. Checking out some of the reactions, it has over 52,000 likes and loves. That is insane. That's a big amount. 7.6 thousand comments, 854 shares. So here you can see a husband tagging his wife. Pretty much that, just a lot of people tagging their wives or their significant others. Now this website is done very well. So I like the background. I like the all black. I've always liked black, but aside from that, it's pretty well made. It's straight to the point. It's got very high quality images. These don't look like the typical images you're going to find at AliExpress, but we'll find that out in a little bit. A simple description, information on the shipping and the returns, a cozy knit sock set. So this is pretty cool because this is one of those that gets people to make an additional purchase. I know you're looking at this, but you know what would go great with this? These socks. Aside from that, if you scroll down, you have the different variations and all of the different reviews, which are actually really good. 4.7 out of five stars. Overall, I think it's great. I think it's very well made. Miss Cozy is a perfect name for something like this because obviously this is geared more towards women and it's giving you the feeling of comfort. So Miss Cozy is a perfect name. So the three piece is actually running for $133. That is pretty expensive. So 133, let's go ahead and check out our suppliers so the three-piece set is running for twelve dollars and 56 cents on sale right now but we're going to do the full price and we're going to subtract 22 dollars and 84 cents and it has free shipping so overall they're making a total profit of about 110 dollars per sale that is absolutely insane i would feel a lot more comfortable making a purchase of 133 dollars on a website like this than i would on a website like this I'm not gonna lie to you this does not give me the confidence that this does this is very well branded. It's very well put together. The images are great. And overall, this is a lot nicer experience than something like this. So as you can see, it's all about your branding. It's all about how you brand your website, how you brand your items, how you display your items. If you do it properly, you could charge some pretty good money for your items. All right, so this next item is geared towards all DIYers and crafting enthusiasts. And that's gonna be an epoxy resin silicone mold set for chess. So let's go to the Facebook ad. And here you can see that they're simply placing some epoxy resin over the mold. They're squaring it out to the little squares. Then they're filling it up completely. So pretty much just showing you how it works, how the epoxy resin works. You gotta give it time, it hardens up, then you can peel it off and you have your own custom chessboard. Obviously you can change the different colors based off of the different epoxy that you put in there. And they also have different molds for pieces. So this helps you create your own chess set a customized chess set for whatever colors that you want to add on there. So let's go over to the website and they have Let's Resin. So this is simply the mold set. This does not come with the actual resin. This is just the molds with the colors that you can add to the resin. So for those of you that don't know, resin is a material or a type of liquid that comes in two parts. You mix it together and then you put it into whatever mold you want or you set it wherever you want to set it. And after some time, typically about after a day, it gets hard and then you can use it for almost anything you want. There's a huge market for this because this is what a lot of people do to sell their custom items on, let's say, Etsy. So there's a lot of items that go along with this, such as molds. So for this mold set, you can see that it's going for $27.49. Now, I don't see anything about free shipping, so I'm gonna add about $13 for shipping, which is typical for my area. But let's look at the website itself. So we have Let's Resin. I like the name. It goes perfectly with the theme of the item itself. The logo, I mean, that's really personal. Honestly, the logo is not really bothering me. The name of the store is perfect, so I'm good with that. Scroll down a little bit, buy it with, and save 10% to bundle. This is great. This is a great way to upsell. You have your reviews here, a description, which is collapsible, which I really like. Shipping policy, same thing. Then you have actual images of the item itself. So overall, this is a pretty well-structured website. I like the way that they structured it. I think it's straight to the point, easy to navigate. Could use a couple of extra pops of colors here and there because of the type of item that it is. But overall, Pretty good job. So let's go ahead and run over to our supplier at AliExpress. And here we can see that they have the chessboard for $10.60. Now let's go ahead and add that to our chess pieces. 
which is going to be $8.69, which gives us a grand total of $19.29. Let's add $4.00. 78 cents for shipping equaling out to 24 dollars and seven cents so jumping back over to the actual website we can see it's for 27 dollars and 49 cents plus 13 dollars for shipping 40 dollars and 49 cents now let's take off our item price 24 dollars and seven cents which gives us a potential profit of 16 dollars and 42 cents all right so for the last item on our list we have a universal car window screen so this is a pretty cool one because what this does it simply just goes over your car window and it provides a screen on it. So you can roll down your window and enjoy the air, enjoy the breeze without any nasty bugs or anything like that coming in. So this item is currently going for $19.95. I don't see anything telling us that they're not charging us for shipping. So I'm gonna assume that they are. So something like this can come in a small packaging. So I'm gonna simply add about $6 for shipping. So $25.95. Now taking a look at the website that it's through Los Posse, Los Posse, I'm not entirely sure, but overall the structure of the website itself is not not good at all i don't like it whatsoever they don't have the menu bar up here for one they have this little collapsible one which i don't think it really works for the type of website that we're on but sure scroll down you have this countdown it's telling you that the sale ends in seven hours i don't like this right here i think this is a little bit excessive just simply having hours minutes and seconds would be enough scroll down a little bit more you have the different styles the different sets some trust badges guaranteed checkout and then just your usual drop shipping website. You have the GIFs with the images, GIFs and images. So for the reviews, they have a little box here, which is all right. At least they have the reviews on there. This down here, the add to cart. I like the fact that they have a sticky add to cart, which means at any point as you're looking through the website, you can add it to your cart. This one is a bit too bulky. It's too big. I don't think it fits well. Something smaller would be a lot better. And a lot of times they don't actually have it at the bottom. They have it at the top. So jumping over to our supplier's website, we can see that they're actually only running for $1.72 each. That's... That's really cheap with $5.94 shipping. So let's go ahead and pull out our handy dandy calculator. This one's running for $19.95. We said $6 in shipping. Now let's go ahead and subtract the item cost, which is going to be $1.72. And then let's subtract the shipping, which is going to be $5.94, giving us a grand total profit of $18.29. Not bad. So as you saw, most of the items on today's list were actually with a profit margin of over $15, except for the smaller items. But the majority of them had a pretty high ticket drop shipping price. Now, hopefully you enjoyed this video and you found these items helpful. If you did, make sure you smash that like button and hit that subscribe button. Also remember to get access to the cheat sheet. Just go ahead and leave a comment down below with the hashtag December 2023. And let me know which one of these items was your favorite. Huge thank you once again for watching, especially if you made it all the way to the end. Truly means a lot. As always, my name is Mario with AutoDS. Catch you all next time.